welcome to Jana's on tour. Hi there guys, welcome back to another episode of Jana's on tour. It is the 18th of March 2023 and it is match day. We're already here at the Theatre of Greens. Rich is here too. Hi everyone. How are you doing Rich, you good? I'm feeling very competent, yeah. We'll have a little chat with Rich in a minute. So guys, today it is Plymouth Argyle versus Forest Green Rovers. The first time I've actually ever seen them live and you as well, Rich? Yeah. Yeah. Um, obviously Forest Green Rovers, um, bottom of League One. However, for me, we cannot un underestimate them. They're fighting for their lives probably going to be the first team to to go down this season however it's a big stadium for them to come to probably you know a big day out for them um they're going to want to put on a show if they can so we cannot underestimate them one bit we obviously come off the back of a 3-0 loss at barnsley which wasn't ideal however we need to be coming back you know coming back today and trying to have a strong get a strong result it's going to be tough but i fancy us to do it to grind out a result i'm going for a 2-0 win a lot of people are predicting 4-5-0 just need to get the job done today just need to stay ahead of ipswich and that's all that's all that matters after today obviously we're going to another tough game away at accrington and then in a couple weeks time is the big one at wembley but for now the league is the business we've got to do it so guys we'll see you see you inside for match action come on your greens hey, we're back with rich how you doing rich very good all good big game today rich obviously bottom of the league today but like i just said in the intro can't be underestimated no for a team that, a team that everybody should be beating but we all don't, don't underestimate them no, no. Doubt. and like i said it's a big day out for them they're going to want to try and play well and and you know prove a few people wrong maybe yeah, and I need you. And I'll worry with the Duncan Ferguson, not one of my authority manager yet. No, Duncan Ferguson. It's the first time seeing him down here as well, for a while. Best sit foot giant. <laughs> yeah, um, and they've got up front Garrick, is it? It used to be on loan. Yeah, Jordan Dowd, they were on last season. Yeah, so he's one that we know about. Only um, one we know. <laughs> that's it. But apart from that, you, you fancy us to get the job done today? I feel all I need to do a team up with yeah, so you think that goals today? We need it. I'm doing 4 0. 4 0. Oh, you see, I've been a bit more cautious, gone for 2 0. <laughs> just think that we just, it doesn't really matter for me, like, um, how many goals we score. We've just got to stay ahead of Ipswich for me. We have to. Goal difference now is too great, I think, to catch Ipswich. So, as long as we're winning the game, staying ahead, that's the main thing. Obviously, after today, Accrington away, another tough game. On Tuesday night. One yeah. we should try and, we need to try and win, though. We need it at the day our team in arms. Yeah, and, and so we need to make it count. Yeah. And then obviously the big one in two weeks' time, Wembley. We're all sorted for that one. All done and dusted. Um, as you probably can tell already, the quality of the video is a little bit better on an iPhone now. So hopefully we'll be able to get some better match action as well. Definitely. Just in time for Wembley. Perfect time. Yeah. And Rich, well, I'll let you get to your selling. It is um, Armed Forces Day today, so support the troops. Yeah. And um, let's hope for a big result today. We need a bit of so, yeah. It. Come on, your greens. Come on, you team. Yeah. Take the match, team, for
Hi guys, half time, Plymouth Argyle 1, Forest Green Rovers 0. Um, it's been a bit flat, Rich. Very really flat. Yeah. In my mind, it felt like Buddy Danny down there. A bit like a training ground match, yeah. I mean, yeah. Like, we've not had to come out of second gear really. Forest Green aren't posing much of a threat, so like we just spoke to a guy then, he said Argyle don't really need to huff and puff too much, but it would be nice to sort of up it a bit more in the second half and try and a bit more excitement for the yeah, fans. Yeah, I think they time wrap the game at then, they Yeah, down. Just, yeah. Just get another two or three, just wrap it up yeah. and then keep it easy. That's it. So um, Bolton's first goal for us, uh, corner. Big lad's got his head on it, uh, what for 1 0 quite yeah. early on. Brilliant, Adam. Yeah, Danny Mayer um, had a shot, hit the post, um, and obviously was a bit unlucky with that one. Unlucky, there. yeah. Yeah, but you know, overall, we're in control, but it would just be nice to up it a bit more second half and, um, you know, get a couple more goals and send but, us home um, a bit happier. A bit more with luck, yeah. yeah. Ipswich are winning at the moment, so the main thing is that we just stay in the lead um, and we stay in second place for today. And until Tuesday night, yeah. Until Tuesday night, yeah. So, guys, let's hope we can get some more action in the second half. I hope you agree right. that the uh, quality has been a bit better on the vlog with the iPhone. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's, it's looking good. Obviously, Sean, quickly before we go, what are you yeah. made of it? All right, it's quite good. Yeah, getting the job done so far, aren't yeah, we? But just not much excitement. Yeah. Job done. That's it. All right, guys, we'll see you for the second half. But hopefully, we can add a couple more goals um, by the end of the day. Come on, the Greens. Come on, Got the job done in the end. It wasn't the most exciting game, but we got there in the end. Three points, that's all that matters. Come on, the boys. Hi there guys, we're back in the car. Plymouth Argyle 2, Forest Green Rovers nil. Simple thing to say, job done today. Oh, isn't it, Rich? Yeah, job done. It looked like we named got out of 30 here, didn't we? No, we didn't. I mean, we've got, we've got a lot of games coming up, big games coming up, so you can see why the lads, you know, didn't want to overexert themselves. But, you know, playing a team bottom of, bottom of the league with uh, no confidence, you could sort of see that. You, you do, know, yeah. they had flurries against us, but didn't really cause us any problems. And obviously got the early goal in the second half, Bally Mumba, header. So two headers today won it for us. Um, and yeah, we just sort of saw the game out after that. Not too many chances, but enough to win the game. Another clean sheet and 
That's all that matters, really. Not on that map, yeah. Yeah. And was, Tuesday night, a big one for us. Tuesday night at Accrington, another big one. Obviously, results didn't really go our way today. Barnsley won away at Wickham and Ipswich won at home against... Who are they playing? Will be. It was against Rosebury. So, yeah, we just got to keep winning our games and hope that the others sort of slip up on the way. But not the most exciting day, but job done. Three points. Happy Nine days. matches left. Nine matches left. We're in the business end yeah. now. Results, business, and we just need the, the wins, don't we? Nine win and we just do it. Exactly. <laughs> happy. You thinking, Sean? Yep. Amazing. Yeah, happy with the result? Yeah. Even though it wasn't the most exciting? It was a most exciting game, but a win's a win. A win's a win, exactly. That's it. So, guys, talking about excitement, two weeks' time, we'll be on our way to Wembley for the Papa John's Trophy Final. We will be there. We will be vlogging it. Um, so hopefully we have a we all have a good day out on that one. Whatever the result, I'm sure we'll enjoy ourselves. Oh, definitely. But to win it would, would be a, would be really good as well, wouldn't it? Big time would be amazing. Yeah. So we'll um, we'll be vlogging, travelling up. We'll be vlogging um, sort of the atmosphere before the game. We'll get as much of the game on as we can, and um, and that'll probably up up the next day, the following day on the Monday that one because it's going to be a late return, I think, isn't it? Oh, late. Yeah. yeah. So uh, so tune in for the Wembley vlog. We're three subs away from 800, so if we can get to 800 before Wembley, that would be a really good milestone for Amazing, us. Amazing, yeah. And uh, yeah, we appreciate all the support, and um, 800 is 200 away from our target of 1,000 subs, which is what we always said we wanted when we started the channel, so we are closing in on that. Chosen, and, uh, yeah. And we thank, thank you for all the support and everything like that. So guys, thanks for tuning in again to Jana's on tour. Hope you've enjoyed the vlog. Um, the picture quality is a lot better on this iPhone, so we're ready for Wembley, uh, where we can get some good match footage, hopefully. Definitely, Dan, okay. yeah. So guys, thank you for tuning in. We will see you in two weeks' time for the Papa John's Trophy Final at Wembley. Come on, you greens. Come on, you greens. Green on me. Come on. Oh,